She is an angel who fell to earth. She has blonde hair and red lips and flawless white skin. As she slowly rose, the wings on her back flick slightly. <gasps> Just last night, a white light flashed in the sky and landed violently in Jim's pool. The, the water woke Jim from his sleep. He came outside to check the situation. There was a woman with wings floating in the pool. Jim immediately jumped into the water and helped the woman up. Jim was stunned by her statuesque beauty. He carried the woman back into the house and immediately turned around to find a towel. But as soon as he turned his head, the woman's body, which had just been soaked through, was now dry. Jim patted the back of her hand and tried to wake her up. He leaned over her chest and listened for a heartbeat. She was probably not breathing, so he'd immediately lifted her head and gave her artificial respiration. She gradually regained consciousness. Then a white light came on. The, the woman opened her blue eyes and looked even brighter. Her angelic face struck Jim's heart. He was convinced that such a woman could only be found in heaven. She was an angel who had fallen to earth, but the angel's wings were injured. Jim reassured her that he would find a doctor to fix her wings. The angel wanted to kiss Jim as a token of his gratitude. This frightened Jim immediately bounced away. He thought, are all angels so outgoing? But the angel just wanted to thank Jim for his kindness. Jim couldn't resist such passion and agreed to kiss her. However, the next moment had passed out. The next day Jim woke up on the couch. It turns out that everything last night was just a dream. Jim seemed a little lost and started to clean up the messy room. But when he looked up, he saw an angel appear in front of him with beauty and holiness. The angel from his dream actually comes to him and she screams like a dolphin. Jim was stunned, but then some of his friends knocked on the door. Jim gestures for her to hide in order to protect the angel. He then prepared to coax his friends to leave quickly, but his uncharacteristic behavior was seen to be suspicious. Soon they rushed into Jim's room and found little feet wriggling under the covers. They shouted in excitement and lifted the covers. The beauty and holiness of the angel truly stunned Jim's friends. Her flapping wings also made them realize that she was an angel. So a few men immediately came up with a way to make money. They wanted to send the angel to the circus to exhibit and make money. But Jim shouted at them and told them to get rid of the idea. Jim came home and bandaged the angel's wings. He was just thinking about how to send the angel back home when his girlfriend Patty knocked on the door. She hadn't been able to reach Jim all day. Instead, she saw a woman standing in Jim's room. She couldn't believe that her boyfriend wasn't answering her calls because he was cheating on her. Patty immediately gets angry and leaves the room. Jim was going to go after her, but then the angel falls on her face in his house. He rushes up to check on her, worried about her injuries, but he just fell into this angel's trap. I wonder what man could resist not falling in love with her. Jim took her to the church to get help from the priest in order to send the angel back to heaven. The angel, who was alone in the church, was posing like a statue, but then a woman came to pray. The angel caused a commotion. Jim was so frightened that he took the angel away immediately. Jim made her change into human clothes to hide her identity as an angel. The angel wrapped in a big coat and put on high heels and then lost the ability to walk independently. The two of them went to the library to check the books related to angels. When Jim found an old portrait and showed it to the angel, she immediately let out a high decibel scream. Immediately, the angel could not contain her excitement. The wings on her back were about to be opened. The eyes of the people around her were wide open. Jim had no choice but to carry the angel on his shoulders and leave quickly. He was tired after a long day. Jim Saturday in the car with the angel and ate. He showed the angel how to eat a burger, but when the angel opened his mouth, the burger also opened a mouth. Jim was alarmed by the angel's tendency to scream. He tried to calm the angel down, but their passionate glances almost made Jim lose his virginity. He had to get out of the car and calm down alone. The angel was still a bit lost. The next moment, the aroma of french fries hit her nose. She picked up one of the fries and was instantly attracted to the taste. After all, there is no such thing as french fries in heaven. Then the angel immediately ate the fries without concern for her beauty. At that moment, some of Jim's friends found the angel who was alone. They tempted her with the sizzling fries. Jim called his girlfriend from a phone booth to explain the situation, but his girlfriend was angry. Jim was walking around with his head down after being hung up on. Then he looks up and sees some of his friends. Jim No way are you gonna take her! Jim returns home with his angel, but then his father-in-law to be finds him and wants to 
revenge his daughter. He was cursing Jim all the time, but then he sees the angel a second later. Then he immediately becomes friendly and introduces himself as the father of Jim's girlfriend. Jim was going to explain that it wasn't what he had thought it was. Instead, he asked Jim to make a promise to take care of this lovely lady. It seems that the charm of the angel is really unstoppable. At night, the angel came to Jim's room. She opened her arms and wanted Jim to hug her, but Jim made it clear that he had a girlfriend and was getting married. The angel left sadly. On the other hand, Jim's friends haven't given up on their plan to make money. They caught Angel in a net and took her away when she was alone. Jim found out that Angel was not home and drove around looking for her all night, and his friends have planned a press conference. They want to reveal Angel's identity to the public and use her to make a lot of money. Jim arrives in the nick of time and rushes on stage to save Angel. The friends were upset. They were fighting with each other. The Angel also stretched out her feast and punched a man down. The scene was chaos. Jim immediately picked up Angel and left. The reporters also saw that this woman is really not ordinary. So the reporters came out to take pictures, but they were met with a firm refusal from Jim. Jim wouldn't allow them to interview the angel. He said, she is mine. Jim's girlfriend saw the scene on the TV and was furious. Jim took the angel to a small treehouse in the forest to avoid the news reporters. He thought he would let the angel leave the earth when she recovered from her injuries. However, the angel was still screaming from the pain of her wings. When Jim fell asleep, she went to the forest alone. She removed the bandages from her wings to feel the joy she had not felt in a long time. The angel soars between the mountains, the lakes and the sea. But when she returned to Jim, she tied her wings with bandages again. The angel did this because she didn't want to leave Jim. That day Jim removed the leaves from the trees. He saw a seam that made his pupils quake, so he immediately turned around. But his heart stirred so that he could not help but to open the leaves again. It turned out to be an angel bathing in the lake. After spending some time together, the two of them could only see each other. But Jim soon found that the wound on the angel's wing was as good as new. It was time to send her away, although he was very sad to leave. But he couldn't risk letting the angel stay on earth. The angel held the pillow Jim had slept on tightly in his arms and tried to remember his scent. A tear in the corner of her eye spoke of her sadness, but Jim made his decision and took the angel to the forest. He watched the angel disappear into a white light. At that moment, his angry girlfriend came with her family and guns. She wants to find the mistress and tear her apart. Instead, she was attacked by the angel's legs. Just as Jim's father in law be grabbed him by the collar, his friends arrived. They were locked in a melee. Jim collapses to the ground. Suddenly there was a flash of lightning and a white light in the sky. The angel comes down again to avenge Jim's death. She sends a wave of localized rain to Jim's girlfriend and father-in-law to be. Then she signals Jim's friends to help the fainted Jim. Jim was taken to the hospital. It turns out he already had a serious tumor. The angel came to him again that night and took the sleeping Jim into his arms. When Jim woke up the next day, he was stunned again by the face he saw in front of him. She asked Jim if he liked her like this. By now the angel had not only lost her wings, but had also learned human language. She gave up her angelic identity in order to heal Jim to gain a true love. No one can refuse a beautiful angel, but angels only choose pure and kind men. Jim used his sincerity and kindness to create a fantasy love.